the heck is that up there? Jesus Christ! Huh. Jesus. Oh, that is Jesus. Huh. Wonder if we could get up there. You think we could get up there? I think we could find out a way to get up there. Good morning, YouTube. Got back from a surf session. We're starving. We're looking for some breakfast. I'm the dude's got it. It's meal time. It's meal time. All right. He's going to own the channel pretty soon. I, I have a feeling. I'm taking over this channel. Yeah, this place is cool. Tortoise. Oh, yeah. Oh, one of these surf stickers. Robert. The that is cool. Yeah. That's this where is, we're staying. This is where we're staying. Hola. Buenos dias. So how was that surf this morning, that Dawn Patrol? Patrol. How'd you feel about that? It was pretty good. Like, pretty good. They're small, but if you get the right waves, you get a pretty long ride. Yeah, yeah it was like fun. Longboard waves. So the coffee's here, and there's the sugar. I like the sugar. It's almost like it's a brown, brown sugar, like a cane sugar. It's dark. Of course, coffee, mate. And the leche. Here we go, the Mexican coffee. Hmm. That's rather nice. Not too strong. I think I'll just drink it black. Yeah, it's fine, black. Oh, cool. You figured out how to get to the Jesus statue. Yeah. Oh, awesome. All right, so there is a place to go under the bridge. It's like 900 meters. All right. So we're in search of the big Jesus. That's right. Jesus. Stay with us. It's going to be good. Jesus. It's not going to be too religious, I promise. Oh, it is cooking right there. Look at that. Serious home style Mexican cooking. Yeah. Are you looking forward to this? Dude, they cook Breakfast. right in front of your face. All right, I think I'm gonna go for the eggs first. Okay. Get it while it's hot. It's got onions, I think, tomatoes. All the veggies are fresh. Oh, here we go. And the tortillas. And the oh, yeah. Need some salsa? Need some salsa. Spicy. Goes really well with the beans and onions. Yeah, eggs are kind of fluffy. Peppers in here. Nice. Oh, we got another one. Oh, they're hot. Now we're up to three of these. Ooh, look at that. I love these, the handmade tortillas. She hand makes these. Here we go. Load them up. A little bit more salsa. Oh, here we go. We got, this, got this stuff again. This is great. This salsa ketchup. Boy, this is the stuff. Sweetens it up a bit. There you go. Breakfast burrito. And here's how you properly wrap a burrito. You got to fold it under like that. That, that way it's not going to leak out. Simple food, but it really is delicious. Gotta love the tortilla. It just hits the spot right after a surf. Mm. That is perfect. It's taco. Wow. There you go. Finish it up. So how's your Spanish? That's, is it caliente? Caliente. Caliente? caliente. Sí, caliente. Ah, hot tortillas. Hot tortillas. Hot, 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 hot. Tortilla fresca. Tortilla fresca. Tortilla fresca. Uh -huh. Fresh tortilla. Mm. Oh, fresh tortillas. Fresh. Okay. Tortilla fresca. Mm -hmm. Best. Yes. What do you think of tortilla fresca? Fresh tortillas, huh? She makes these by hand. Mm -hmm. Just a lot more chewy. They're more moist more chewing. and chewy. Right. But not like it's dry, like California. You can taste tortilla the freshness, fresh. huh? Yeah, I like how she puts them in that little on that little grill there to to cook them. That's the secret right there. Yeah, I mean there it is. It's like you can see right there. She's got the doll making tortillas. 
There you go. Beautiful. This place is magic. There you go, and this flips it. Oh, this is round two, and she's still making them. We've got more here. This is gonna be great. Mm. It's all you can eat. Tortilla, Tortilla fresca. That's good. The real thing is so much better. <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and rate this meal right now before I finish. All right. Six out of six stars. Six no, out no, of no. six. That's right. Comment below for your chance to win. I get some snack pack. The link's up here if you want to check out what's inside the goods. Snack pack winners will be announced in next week's video. And if you like, check out my Snapchat. I've been doing some snaps lately in Mexico. Yeah. It's a good time for Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook. Check it all out. <laughs> Thumbs up this video. Subscribe. It's whatever YouTuber says. Or unsubscribe. The last like a, tortilla. There's like an air pocket in there. That is a beautiful tortilla. So hot. Not much left to put on it. Yeah, no, we're both done. One, this one. It's just gonna be a hot sauce tortilla. It's just a hot sauce. goes. Let's see if we can make this work. Hot sauce only. Okay. Hot sauce tortilla. It's actually really good. <laughs> the tortillas are so amazing. That's really all they need is a little hot sauce. Yeah. Good. Oh. There's the destination right there. The Jesus statue up on the hill. Go check it out. Yeah, there we're way up here. That's where we started from. <laughs> there it is. Coming in the back way. Hopefully we don't get attacked by dogs. Ah. It's our surf break right there. Right there. That's where we're staying. Awesome. Surf is right there. Construction took seven years. 23 meters tall, 75 feet. Wow. Hey, is this the beach right here? Yeah, it's right past the sea. Right past there? Yeah. All right, I'll show you guys the room. Hey, dude, you got it? Shazam. What's up? It's your bed? Mm-hmm. I claimed this one. Yep. Mm. So this is the Surf Motel at K38. Yep. Surf stickers everywhere, you know, in Mexico. They're on windows of businesses everywhere. Surf stickers galore. There's a double bed here, so I'll get that one. Pretty sweet. What's all this? Is this leftover stuff from the river? What is this? What is all this? Oh, here we go. This is what we're after. What are you eating? You're eating more? Mm -hmm. I thought you said you were full. It's like your dessert, you know? Oh, dessert. Well, they, you know, they had dessert. They had chocolate mousse and all that. We could order dessert, but yeah, too fancy. I never order dessert unless, unless you got a lady friend along. Unless you got a lady friend. Yeah. Lady friends equal desserts, guys. Mm -hmm. That's for sure. Mm -hmm. All right, so we stopped at the market, got a few things. What'd you uh, pick up? Looks like melon pond. Mexican melon yeah. pond, yes. I don't even know if it is, but it kind of looks similar. And you know my Instagram name, so I just had it's to buy melon it. melon pond, yeah. I just had to get yeah, it. I got gotcha. you. You are the melon pond guy. Let's try this thing out. I think you're going to be disappointed. It's probably not like the Japanese one. Mm, I'm mildly disappointed, but still decent. Still decent. I don't know. It's not crunchy. Yeah, no. it tastes like sugar coat. It's like sugar cone. Yeah. yeah. Is it nice and soft? It's a bread nice fresh? Yeah. But I think it is a melon pond. Yeah? It's got that flavor? It got it has a smell. It has a smell. It smells oh, okay. like yeah. Wash it down with some uh Bohemia. This place is gorgeous. Surf just right out here. Yeah, I'm waiting for the low tide. Yeah, waiting for the low tide. Here's a wave. Coming in straight in. Yeah, that's rideable. Let me get a bite of that. You get a bite of the melon pond. It smells like melon pond. Hmm. <laughs> it's 
similar. Right? Mm -hmm. It kind of smells and tastes like a mm -hmm. one, but it's just a little bit different. I don't taste like Hawaiian bread, like Hawaiian sweet bread. Yeah, it's very sweet. Mm. It's like an icing on top. Not bad. I haven't had anything to drink since that surf this morning. That was four hours ago. More like five hours ago. Bohemia, this is a good one. I like this better than the Dolzecchi's. It's, it's heavier, it's a stronger lager. Mmm. I finish it right now, right here. Nice. What else we got? What other pumpkin seeds? Things? We got some nuts. Nuts are popular in Mexico. Some little snackies. Hold it. Oh, I like those. These are uh, like sp spicy peanuts, pumpkin spicy seeds, peanuts, uh, and some sweet snacks. It's got in it. I see a little bit of jelly in there and mm. some cream. What I say? Not bad. Not bad. Chocolate cake, sort of. Yeah, chocolate cake ish. What I really like about this place is they've got the ring on the string. Well, it's actually the ring on the hook game. Ring on the string. Well, the ring's on a string, but the, the idea of the game is to get it onto this hook here. That's what you're supposed to do. And it's anchored here in the ceiling, right there, right? So that's what you're gonna try to do. So you get back here, way back here. You're like 12 feet back, and you let the ring sail, and you try to get it to hook on the ring. Close. Let's go to the left. Oh, close. That was really close. All right, we'll come back and try this later. After we've had more beers. It's super chill here. It is super chill. We're like the only ones here. Very relaxing. Yeah. And everything's walking distance. Everything's walking distance. That's nice. Even Jesus. Even Jesus. Give me Jesus. The real distance. Jesus. Yeah, so here's Baja, California. Some of you have been asking me where I am in Mexico. So Baja, California. This is California up here. And this is Mexico. Mainland Mexico is over here, but basically we're only like this far in. You know, we're not very far. Half hour south of the Mexican border, the well, San Diego Mexico border. This guy's going out short board. Yeah. If you ding your boards on the rocks out there, this guy'll fix them for you. It's pretty cool, huh? More candy. What's the next snack? It's okay. It's like marshmallow, and I think you get a. Uh... Strawberry jam. Marshmallow, and strawberry jam, and a chocolate coating. With some cookie on the bottom, I think. Hmm. It's not that good. Okay, I'm gonna be trying some of these, the uh, spicy nuts, and get them open. It's a trick. Oh, they open on this end. No Ziploc bags here. Let's get a nice, healthy mouthful. They smell pretty spicy. Oh! <laughs> it's just like salsa. I mean, uh, hot sauce. They're really good though. Mm hmm. It's like peanuts with hot sauce on them. Pretty good though. How do I get this open? It's a bottle opener. River rafting paddle. Mm. All right now we've got the pumpkin seeds. These are from Tijuana. Looks like they're dry roasted. Mm, pretty nice. I just eat the shells and everything with these. But if you want, you can just crack them open. And you get the seed like that. What do you guys do when you eat pumpkin seeds? Do you eat it with the shell or without? So you do it. Oh, close. Close. Get it, get it. Oh. Come on, is it really that hard? It's really hard. It's really 
hurry up, I'm running out of SD card. Oh yeah, look at the size of that cactus. Beautiful. Tree looking cactus, dude. Yeah, it's cactus tree size. Yeah, place is cool, huh? Very cool. We're looking for a uh, place to eat. Here we go, how about this place? This looks good. I don't know, it's the only place. Is it? it's the only, yeah, it's kind of like our only choice. It's a restaurant bar, I think. Charlie's place. Oh yeah, the beer truck, the beer van. Oh, that's pretty cool. We're going here. Check it out. Yep, just got back from surfing, looking for some dinner. Yeah, it's like a whole, yeah, it's a ship. Try the white sauce. Yeah. Oh boy, tasting like the French onion. I think this is French onion dip. It's really good. Mm, tasty. And the really mm. spicy looking one. I like that middle one. That's just... Yeah, I like the middle one too. Yeah. It's probably the highest calories. All right, and this one. I have a feeling this is gonna be spicy. Mm. Not that hot. There was an adult taste, mm. so. Herbs and spices. This is just the basic salsa. Put a lot of goodies in there. And I guess you can kind of mix and match too. Wow. Awesome. Definitely good eats. Alright, I'm gonna go for the spicy one first. Okay. It's not that spicy. It looks looks like it'd be spicy, but it's really not. No. Yeah. Mm. It's not salsa. I don't know exactly what it is. Smells great though. Good? Yeah. Yeah, try this one. I think you might like, I like this, this one. one. Yeah. Yeah. Not more creamy. Creamy, right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, fatten yourself up in this. This is the fresh salsa. This is really the best one. This, I mean, this, is, the best this one, yeah. is the this is the love of Mexico right here. Salsa, freshly made salsa. Get some more on there, dude. Get into this. Look at how how much stuff this has in it. Look there. how chunky that is. Just get a huge basket. I love that they just give yeah. a huge basket. I mean, everybody, right? Huge basket. Yeah. What do you think of the real deal, Mexico? Chips are awesome. Right, every meal, every meal that we've every, had so far has been the best awesome. Part right? about this trip is actually the food. Really? Oh, look at this! So the guacamole has arrived. You order guacamole, you get there's probably that's probably two avocados in there. It's massive. Look at that. And you can either use it with chips, right? Like he's done, yeah. or you, can, you can cut up your burrito and just sort of add it to that. Yeah. Burrito too. How is the guac? What do you think? It's good, guacamole. Yeah, he's giving it the he's giving it the okay. He's giving it the okay. A little bit plain, so you probably want right. That's a bit of well, that's too. that's the whole deal. It's a, I think it's supposed to be like that because they've got all this other stuff that you can combine it with, and these sauces over here as well. So yeah, it's definitely you, you're going to create your own taste for this. Yeah. So uh, what? What burrito did you get? These are pretty good sized burritos. I think I got the garlic for like shrimp. six bucks. Garlic, garlic, shrimp. garlic shrimp. Nice. Yeah. Freshly chopped veggies. There's the shrimp. I see it. Yeah. Wow. That's a lot of stuff in there. And you're gonna go right for adding more guac. Oh yeah. I'm addicted to guac. Yeah. It's good I stuff. am addicted to avocados. Yeah. Yeah. It's a California thing. You've been in California for how long now? One like one year, year right? Yeah. Good luck. You're gonna try to wrap that back up and eat it with your hands. Yeah. This could be. A, this is the challenge, I guess. We're gonna fill these burritos up even more and then try to eat them with our bare hands right. rather than using the knife and fork. Right? Is that the yeah. challenge? Yeah. Okay. Let's see how he does, guys. Oh, this is gonna be a major mess. You're gonna need all those napkins over there. He's going for it. Look at him go. I think you might want to use the fork and knife. No. No way? Oh, sure. Dude, look good. at that, man. Look at that thing. Is it heavy? It's chunky. Chunky. Yeah? Look at him go. Mm. like a competitive eater. What are you tasting? Are you tasting the shrimp? Are you tasting the guac? Tasting the garlic. Are there beans and rice in there? What, what's the up? the garlic with the shrimp. And the very fresh vegetables. Oh, there's veggies. Okay, so stir fry, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Nice. I think it's tomatoes and lettuce. Mm. Look at him go. Oh man, that mm. looks good. Get that. A real Mexican burrito. 
<laughs> We're loving it. We're loving it. This is, man, awesome. this is making me so hungry. I'm the cameraman. This is making me so hungry. Oh man, I'm starving over here. I'm suffering over here. Look at this. Look at this. I'm just dying to eat this. I'm not making too much of a mess. Yeah. Well, we surfed twice today, right? Mm -hmm. And we've only eaten once, so yeah, I get it. All right. Try. You want to try the green? Yeah, pass on that. I think I'll just stick with these four. Yeah, stick with the ones that they bring out. Look at him go, man. He's just mauling this. Look at him go. <laughs> man. I think I might have to retire from Eric meal time and we'll call it dude's meal time. Yeah, maybe dude's meal time. This is awesome. It does look really good. Is there a lot of shrimp in there? Is it really meaty? Yeah, you taste all the shrimp. Garlic shrimp, right? So yeah, it's garlic shrimp, so you taste the garlic. I can shrimp. smell it, yeah. And then the veggies are just so fresh. He hasn't even used a napkin yet. Uh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, and clear. All right. Nicely done. Nicely done. Look at that. Close up of the hands. Yep. Yeah. Here's the knife and a clean knife. Look at the knife. Woo. Clean knife. The one I ordered here is the grilled fish burrito. Right, so dissect, dissect it for let's us. Let's cut into it. Yeah, I'll give you a cross section look. You still hungry? I can give you half of this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here we go. There you go. Yeah, yeah, it looks pretty good. This is the fish on this side, on and the then top. it's like different types of like veggies. coleslaw veggies. Yeah. yeah, there's the fit right there. Clearly, you can see the fish there. Yeah, look at that's a big, nice grilled fish. Oh. That is some really nice fish. I've just got a big bite of fish now. Nice. Mm. Wow, you know what? It's really good just like this. Mm. I'm tasting it, some cilantro. Does it have any flavor without any salsa? It's, it the does, fish by itself is really good. Flavor. It's, it's very salty, flavorful. It's pepper, it's, uh, yeah. There's some salsa in here already. Yeah. It's delicious. Some onions. Oh, it tastes so good. Definitely the flavor of the sea. Flavor of the sea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think those fish are pretty fresh too. They right, just, so. just. It's really fresh. Yeah. Oh, wow. Fantastic. Okay, let's uh, add a little bit of flavor here. Yeah, what are you going for? You going some for egg? Maybe some egg in here. No, not egg. That's just a fish. Chunky Put salsa. Some salsa. Chunky salsa goes in there. And the guac. goes with everything. Wonderful Glock. Well, now we'll see if this changes the equation. Oh, even better. Even yeah, better. I bet the Glock makes it, dude. Mm -hmm. The Glock. Mm -hmm. I don't think I've ever had a burrito like this in America before. And I've had a lot of burritos in America. Yeah, this is authentic, the real thing. Mm. Mexico does it right. They do it right. For sure. Try a little bit of this one. I don't know what exactly what that is though. I don't know. I think it's a picante sauce, maybe? Picante. And finishes it half of it. See? Mm. That was pretty quick. Mm -hmm. It was like three bites and you finished it. Hey, I was hungry too. I served too twice. Yeah. Just like you. We were, you know? we were both starving out there. Mm -hmm. The waves, kind of clean, small, fun waves. But just, the best part is we had it to ourselves. There was nobody else surfing out there. Just this one other guy that came yeah. in. But, you know, yeah. That's nice. Soul. The beer of the sun. The beer of the sun. Mexico's version of Corona. <sighs> that's good. Okay, so for the second half, I'm gonna try some of these sauces. All right, are you gonna add any of these guys in here? Yeah, so I noticed these, yeah. I think that means, this. I don't know, maybe you're supposed to cut them and put in a little bit. All right. 
Maybe like, yeah, even half of that. I think this is yeah. There you go. Go real thin here. Just, why don't you just try like a little bit of, yeah, little piece and see how, see how hot it is. Okay, that's a good idea. Oh, not that hot. Not that hot? Not that hot, yeah. All right, there you go. Nice, all right, so we'll go with these. The chili peppers, green chilies. All right, will that stand up? That would be amazing if that just stands up. Look at that. That's how chunky it is, we'll it go stands with, on its own. We're gonna go with some green habanero sauce. Now, I have no idea how hot this is. And what else here? This is salsa habanero. Okay, this is probably got some fire too. I don't know. That might be a bit much. I think you put in like too much. I don't know. We'll see. Whatever. We'll see. Light the fire a little bit. There he goes. Spicy? These, these are really nice. Not that hot. Look at the size of these things. Incredible. Oh. Fantastic. And, uh, and to think we were gonna eat street tacos tonight. <laughs> but the street taco place was closed, closed. right at the street. So. Lunch, maybe for lunch. Yeah. yeah. So we found this place. Mm. Yeah. I'm gonna be lunch tomorrow on the way out of town because we're going heading back tomorrow. We're gonna do the tacos. Oh. All right. Let's go for some more salsa. Just like. I kind of like that you can you make like, your own. Oh, you yeah. ate all of this, so you really yeah, like Yeah, I love this, that oh, creamy really stuff. Like, I think it's ranch onion dip. I'm addicted to but ranch, it's, but it's, too. It's definitely got sort of a I'm more, Mexican flavor. Yeah, to I'm a too, very yeah. ranch and guacamole type of guy. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Look at that stuff dripping out. They're just dripping with flavor. This might just be the best burrito I've ever had in my life. Because <laughs> in America, generally, you're gonna eat chicken, you're gonna eat beef, you're gonna eat pork. Fish burritos are very rare. Yeah, and fresh fish burritos are even more, even more so. Mm -hmm. And the tortilla is so much different down there. The, the, the taste is so much different being that it's, it's made fresh. Or made by hand. All right, here we go. Last bite. Last bite. The volume is, is huge here. Yeah. Charlie's at K38, Baja California, yeah. Mexico. Hits the spot. Mm -hmm. So, care to rate this meal? Yep. Let's see what you give it. On the Eric meal time, time scale. rating scale of one to six, I'm gonna give it a full six stars. Six stars. There's been nothing but sixes down here in Mexico. I know. It's perfect. I told you it's the best part of the trip. Uh, how do you care to rate this meal? Ah, uh, Sammy, you guys saw how fast I chugged that burrito down. You know I gotta give it a six. Yeah, I don't think I've ever yeah. seen you eat that it fast. It was amazing. You got fresh shrimp, fresh veggies, fresh tortillas, just like guacamole, and you can make your own. Like, can't beat this place, so I gave it a six. And if you guys care, check me out on Instagram. I'm Sub Melon Pond. Go put a link down below. We'll put a link down below. Uh, yeah, check follow them out. Me on Instagram. <sighs> and the price for all this: the two burritos, the guacamole, the chips, the beer. Fifteen dollars and fifty-nine cents. What a bargain! Six stars. You know what that means, guys? For those of you that watch meal, Eric Meal Time. I'm giving away six of the, no not six, I'm giving away three <laughs> of the get some snack packs. It's been 80. There's a link up here, you can see what's inside. And the only thing you need to do for your chance to win is put a comment down below and I'll announce the winners in next week's video. So thanks for watching, we'll see you next time. Wow, man, look at that, it's all lit up. What is that thing up there? We, Jesus Christ. Dominicana, la casa del merengue, la casa de la bachata. La, 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 la. 
la casa del merengue La, 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 la Y la casa de la bachata 